martial arts and jumping vampires? Fuck yeah! Introducing Sammo Hung's Encounters of a Spooky Kind. As I've never seen this movie, unfortunately, I'm going to be paraphrasing from what I have read on the IMDb. Hung is the target of a rich guy who is sleeping with his wife. They both want to get rid of him. So Hung is tricked into spending the night in a supposed haunted temple. Rich guy has paid a sorcerer to conjure up a vampire to kill Hung. But his colleague wants to save Hung and counter the devious two. According to the Criterion channel, this was the launch of the hopping vampire craze. Like Jackie Chan, his earliest appearance for me was Enter the Dragon. He's not your typical martial arts star. Why can't they be carrying extra? After Lee's passing, there was a need by Golden Harvest and Shaw Brothers to find someone to fill those big boots. From the mid 70s and onwards, Hung has shown himself to be a different kind of star next to Bruce Lee by building his own brand of martial arts movies, often collaborating with Jackie Chan. Martial arts movies with serious and humorous themes and long establishing himself in world cinema history as one of the best multitaskers, actor, writer, director, fight choreographer. This movie is a perfect example of that. When I saw the trailer, I immediately thought of the Evil Dead. But Sam Raimi was in early stages of shooting when this movie came out. It bears the ingenuity and humour of that American movie. I had to add this to my list and hopefully some of you will check it out. Looking into what other people have said about it, I found a couple that said it had its moments. One complaining about a scene with a chicken. The consensus say it's a blast, a classic multi-genre piece for fans of Hong Kong cinema. 